In this short video, we will talk about the force exerted on a current carrying conductor when placed within a magnetic field generated by permanent magnets. When electricity or conventional current flows in a long straight wire, it creates a circular or cylindrical magnetic field around the wire. Let us consider a situation where we position the wire within a magnetic field produced by permanent magnetic poles. The magnetic field produced by the current carrying conductor, the wire, and the magnetic field between the permanent magnetic poles interact. The first scenario we will consider is where the conventional current flow is away from the viewer. The magnetic flux lines generated by the wire are clockwise in orientation. When the wire is placed in the middle of the magnetic field between permanent magnetic poles, the two magnetic fields interact. The field is strengthened just above the wire and weakened just below. This then results in a force acting on the wire, resulting from this magnetic field interaction, causing the wire to move downwards. And now, the second scenario. Consider the conventional current flow is towards the viewer. The magnetic flux lines generated by the wire are counterclockwise in direction. In this case, when the wire is placed in the middle of the magnetic field between permanent magnetic poles, the two magnetic fields interact. The field is now strengthened just below the wire and weakened just above. This then results in a force acting on the wire resulting from these magnetic fields interacting, causing the wire to move upwards. This is the basic principle of operation of the electric motor and majority of moving coil electrical instruments.